Namaste, I'm Anand from India. You can smile at him. This is Nelson Mandela. I'm deeply influenced and inspired by the acts of Nelson Mandela uh, for various reasons, I think, but uh, coming from Africa, uh, leaders, leaders so tall as Mandela to emerge with thoughts and ideals that he lived by uh, when he was imprisoned, incarcerated for 26 years in prison, and to have the courage to come out of prison and say, we need peace and love, rather than to raise a finger and say, let's get revenge, takes a lot of character. Hey, my name is Alice. I'm from Canada. My hero is not the company Facebook, but the COO of Facebook, which is Sheryl Sandberg. She was also the previous vice president at Google. She's my hero because she wrote one of my favorite books called Lean, Lean In, where she poses the question of what would you do if you were not afraid? And that is essentially what all of us students at IHE Delft are doing now by having the courage to come to another country to pursue our masters and to have a seat at the table and lean in into the global conversation about water. Uh, my name is Suleiman Joseph from Nigeria and uh, my specialization is sanitary engineering. And my hero is Mahatma Gandhi, who is famous for modest lifestyle and uh, clean habits. This uh, one of his famous quotes, sanitation is more important than independence. And uh, you can see the simplicity of my work. It's uh, replicated in uh, his kind of lifestyle. And uh, I draw up so much inspiration from his habits. And uh, I come from a region with a lot of sanitation challenges. And I find this quite inspiring uh, from his uh, life. And uh, I draw up on that inspiration to solve sanitation challenges in Nigeria. Hello, my name is Patricia. I come from Peru. Uh, my hero is Marino Morikawa. He's a Peruvian Japanese scientist. And he has revived some polluted wetlands in our country. He used uh, nano nanotechnology for that. What inspires me from him is that he doesn't expect uh, help, external help, but he worries about being a change agent and being an example for others. Hello. <laughs> I'm Del Cacho, I'm from Ethiopia. Uh, I'm studying water science and engineering, specialization in hydraulic engineering and river basin development. Uh, my hero for today is the, the Imperial Tedros II, which ruled Ethiopia in the year of 1855 up to 1868. We consider him as a, nation, a national hero. He's the founder of modern Ethiopia. Uh, he's also the founder of the first African industrial village known as Gafat. The most important lesson that we can learn from uh, this king is that uh, during his region or before his region, the one that comes to uh, power was the royal family, but he came from a low income family and he achieved his dreams. Therefore, the important lesson is that to achieve his dreams, he don't have to come from the, uh, uh, the royal family, but rather you need to have a good vision. So, so that you can achieve that. My name is Cristobal, I am from Chile, and my hero is a military hero of the Aboriginal people, okay? It's what's called, no, it's called Mapuches, okay? His is Lautaro, or Keleftaro in original language. When we, uh, he's a warrior that when was a child was kidnapped for the conquest, and they learn everything about the conquest and then we go up, escape, and lead a war against the conquest, and we win. And he, they kill the leader of the conquest. He is a, it's a, it's a symbol for our, for our people. It's a symbol of resistance, it's a symbol of, uh, of fight. And that's the, that's the reason that I always say Chilean never surrender, because Mapuche never surrender. Okay, that's, uh, that's my hero. My name is Stella from Nigeria. My heroine is my mother. Um, my mother has, she, she really inspires me. Um, my dad died 16 years ago, and my mom was left a widow with five children, but she didn't allow her circumstance to stop her from 
giving us a good education. So as it is now, I'm the first um, female child in my bloodline to finish a university education. And then my siblings, four of them all boys, they are all graduates from the university. So my, my mom's life has really inspired me. Like she didn't allow anything to stop her from achieving what she wants to achieve. And um, so far, growing up with my mother and my <coughs> siblings, I've discovered that there is nothing that can really stop you from achieving your dream. You just put um, hard work with patience and trust in God, then whatever dream you have, you can achieve it. Andre Lopez from Colombia. This is a Greek god. It's called Atlas. He can support the world. Supposedly, this is me, but what you can see is not like me. But it's only symbolical. He can support the world, but the world can be supported by all my family. My family and all my, the members of my family are supporting to me. They are the real inspiration. They are my heroine. Then I can be a strong if my family are strong. They are my heroine. Hello, my name is Hong Yi Yi. I'm from China. I'm studying sustainable urban water management and I make a man. This is the unit of current and this is Omega. He is my physics teacher when I was in my middle school. He inspired me and he made me be aware of the importance of studying. Without him, I think I had come to IHE and not only the physics, but also he makes me uh, to study other subjects well, so uh, I love it. Uh, my name is Mumba Sonda from Zambia. I'm studying water management and governance. This here is my beautiful mother, my hero. Uh, she's taught me that being a woman doesn't mean you can't, you can't achieve anything in life. It's actually an opportunity for you to make a difference in whichever field you are. So I hope to make a difference, a difference, yeah, a difference in the water sector. Hello, namaste. My name is Binay, and I'm from Nepal. I'm here to study in MS in hydraulic engineering and river basin development. And my father has graduated in 1995, as you can see. My dad, he is my hero and uh, he is uh, the one who I have to follow his steps uh, to achieve my goal from this reputed institution, IHU Delft of the Netherlands. One day I'll make him proud and he will be my hero. Hello everyone, I'm Yang Shenna and I'm from China. This is my heroes. Uh, I showed this is uh, some flowers, okay, roses. And in my home garden, there are lots of flowers, like um, the roses and other kind of flowers. And I hardly stay at home, so I hope these flowers can accompany my mom and be together with her. So, um, when I see these flowers, and especially when I face some troubles or difficulties, I always remind uh, these flowers can encourage me to always think about my family. Namaste, I'm Sitis Gautam from Nepal, studying hydroinformatics here at IIT Delft. Uh, my inspiration are my people, countrymen. So they are as calm as the Mount Everest, and they share different cultures. They have different cultures. We have 123 languages, but the common language is water. So they all are based upon water, and we know quite well how to utilize our resources. But we are a bit unpredictable, so I am here studying hydroinformatics so that those water resources could be made predictable by the data science. Hello, my name is Victor and I'm from Nicaragua. Um, I want, I'm studying hydroinformatics and my hero is music. Uh, from all parts in life, I'll, I will always been involved with music and I think it's some, some integral part in my life and I believe that everyone should have a balance between arts and science and I think for me uh, playing guitar and singing is a, com uh, a compl com complement for studying hydroinformatics. Hi, my name is Mary Elizabeth Molly Torello. I'm from the United States of America and I'm studying water supply engineering and my hero is my dog. 
He doesn't take life very seriously. He's always happy every day, and he loves the water.